Hey Pisces, happy 4th of July, my babes. I hope y'all are having fun today. Y'all out with family or friends, or even if you're by yourself, that you are enjoying yourself, Pisces, right? Taking life by the horns, okay, okay. <laughs> A Taurus, a Capricorn, an Aries could be significant, all right? So come on in, Pisces. I love you guys so very much, and I'm so grateful for y'all coming back home to our home planet. It was created just for you, Pisces, so come on in. Let's tap in. I had a special request, and someone, ooh, King of Swords, okay. Someone asked for a Pisces singles reading, so single Pisces, right? So we're going to do that today. What I want to get is the energy that you are emitting out into the universe in regards to love, where you may be, uh, where you might need a little help, where there may be blockages, and what we could do to manifest the love that we truly desire, right? So, Spirit, help me tap in with Pisces, please. <clears throat> help me see what's going on with all my singles out there, those that are desiring relationships, commitment, higher level commitment is what I heard, okay? All right, so, yeah. Ashe, Ashe, Ashe. Archangel Michael, protect me as I channel these energies. Ashe, thank you, Spirit. Thank you, God. Mm -hmm. All right. Don't forget to like the video, Pisces. I keep seeing this damn hangman. All right. Don't forget to like the videos. Exchange some energies with me, but we got the Six of Swords. What's that behind it? Oh, shit, the Seven of Swords. All right, we're going to talk about it. We're going to talk about it. All right, Spirit. So let's get an energy for you, Pisces. Nine of Swords. This is being in your head. This is overthinking something. This is thinking about something way too much. This is like obsessing over something, right? Well, the devil would be more like obsession, but this is like worry and fear. It's still lower level energies right this is like feeling like that thing that that divine person is not coming towards you like i'm hearing they don't exist okay it's or or being worried about this you know a love connection all right spirit what energy is pisces putting out into the universe we got the queen of cups in regards to love what energy are they emitting in the area of love here the queen of cups is very that's our energy that's our natural energy pisces you know what i'm saying uh whether you're masculine or feminine you can oper operate in a queen of cups energy right this is very nurturing this is caring this is loving this is a good cook this is a creative person this person is in touch with their intuition they are tapped in you know what i'm saying they are emotionally stable okay what energy is pisces emitting in love two of wands you're ready you're ready right i heard freddie ready freddie somebody's name could be fred okay freddie frederick frederica i don't know fredisha i don't i don't know all right and the world y'all are ready to close out this this season of singleness but the fuck freaking nine of swords is back on the bottom of the deck what is the worry about spirit A king of swords could be significant for some of you guys. Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. And if this isn't you worrying, it could be somebody else, okay? My, like, the way I believe is you are single until you are married. You know what I'm saying? Or in a higher level commitment. Situationships is not, anyway, I'm not going to, let me be quiet. Um, but yeah. Yeah. The nine of swords. The four of swords is like recuperation recovering okay somebody could want to bring you in an offer pisces but this person if this is not you that's worried here somebody is concerned about bringing in this offer to you this person may be all up in their head i'm telling you you got the nine of swords the four of swords that's a whole lot of goddamn swords right sheesh that's 13 which breaks back down to four. 
it's a small offer and I think this person is concerned about this offer will Pisces take this offer will it's like I don't know if they're missing something that's what it's given it's given like I may not have everything but I do have this uh I heard slumber or this uh like someone wants to give you rest someone wants to give you reprise as well I don't know what that even means what that means Repri reprise what is that let me look it up shit hold on Pisces reprise am I even spelling it right <laughs> what does that mean somebody tell me what it means <laughs> down in the comment section a reprise on here it say a repeated passage and music i don't know so music could be significant for someone here okay someone could even be sending you songs or messages through your dreams here all right this is humble beginnings though pisces this is very much humble beginnings here with this ace of cups tell me more about this king of swords what is this Baby, who this here, Pisces? Who this here? You got the Emperor and the Seven of Pentacles. Somebody. <laughs> I heard two different things. Somebody has been very patient. Somebody is going to get what they reap, what they sow. Period. Right? Okay. What is this that this that they're sowing? <laughs> What is this Seven of Pentacles for the Emperor? The Magician. Oh my freaking gosh. And the Hierophant. So I don't know if this is your energy, Pisces, or somebody else's energy, but somebody is definitely manifesting an Emperor here, right? This has been something that has been like, it's been taking a minute for this person to get to you, Pisces. But the Magician is here. And the high refined, higher level commitment. So spirit, what is it that Pisces, what energy does Pisces need to tap further into to get to this manifestation here? That's too many. Damn, 77 could be significant, all right? You actually have 777, y'all, July the 7th, okay? 777, that day could be very, very significant. It is literally going to be one of the luckiest days, like, this year. You know what I'm saying? Some of you guys could have really dealt with a lot of illusions in love. A lot of empty promises a lot of just straight up people not showing you their true colors or you know what i'm saying like just being sneaky all right you got the seven of cups with the seven of swords this is a whole lot of illusions a whole lot of lying sneaking cheating all the other stupid shit you understand what i'm saying but look what's under the secrets cheating lying stealing well i don't know about stealing creeping cheating secrets it's true love right up under there a lot of you guys have been looked over right and underestimated lots of you guys are loners right very much tapped into that cup energy right that queen of cups king of cups energy some of you guys could have dealt with uh being in a third party situation as well here okay exactly you got third party collaboration right Somebody gassing up your head, lying, not being 100% honest, causing lots of fucking confusion, right? For things to be out of order in your relationship with them or your situation, whatever you want to call it, right? <laughs> All right? Ran through. Ho. Y'all could have dealt with dishonest people that were not only giving you them, but giving themselves to others, okay? This is a whole ho okay i'm just saying all right and we got cold-blooded deceit with messenger communication like lots of lies lots of gaslighting lots of of 
just yeah no oh shit gossip and too fat i don't like that mm -mm, i don't like that at all right but then you got the hangman the six of the hangman came out first then the six of swords the hangman is like i heard martyr okay but so you could have really like sacrificed that's it spirit like you could have sacrificed things for others like in relationships you could have downplayed your own needs for others this man look hungry af my ninja y'all get this man to play a barbecue please all right who brought the potato salad though um, i need to know first don't put none of that shit on my plate till i know who made it but anyway yeah <laughs> like you guys could have really been the sacrifice is what i heard okay okay <laughs> okay but it's time to come out of this energy pisces it's time to know <laughs> it's no no more sacrificing your needs and your wants your desires and things like that for others it, it, you can't it can't no you, it can't happen it can't happen any longer like literally this is what i'm hearing you got the six of swords here and this is moving from that uncertain um probably blinded ass view you know what i'm saying um those choppy waters into calmer waters right you got the strength on the bottom of this deck. The two of swords. Not knowing, you know what I'm saying? It's like something something has been blocking someone's like intuition or being able to get fully tapped in or even, even trusting your intuition, right? The two of swords, you, you guys could have dealt with a lot of, okay, do I go in my head or do I go in my heart? Like, I know my head, like I, I'm... I, I, I'm seeing the signs, but I, but do I go with my heart? Because I really, really love this person. I really care about them. Da, 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 da. Lots of that. Which has kept you in stalemate, it looks to be that way. Dragons could be significant. Mythical creatures, okay? You could, like, connect or resonate with... Um, even star seeds, um, astral projection, um, just very much. Uh, I'm hearing like otherworldly, like fairies and and etheric etheric beings. Okay, ethereal. You could look ethereal or something. But it's a guard over you or something like that. Like something here is like no. No, I'm not letting anyone else in because no, you niggas is all the same. Excuse me. You people are all the same. <laughs> you people. <laughs> Why am I like this? <laughs> what you mean, you people? <laughs> anyway. The strength with the ace of coins. <sighs> what energy is needed from Pisces spirit? For some of you guys, somebody here needs to go out. You just need to doll up and go out. You need to get out in the public eye. Somebody has to get back out there. Somebody got to get back out there because there's an emperor over here waiting. What the emperor waiting on from Pisces, spirit? You, you okay? Not the give it to God card. Not the give it to God card. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I got the key, the key, the key. He got all the keys, bruh. He got all the keys. What's the key though, spirit? The queen of pentacles. Look at how her arms are open though, Pisces, right? Look at old boy right here with the owl, right? You got a lot of wisdom, a lot of knowledge, a lot of, 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 of you, you got a lot of experiences, right, that you've been through. But you can't allow those experiences to have you with a closed off heart. The Queen of Pentacles is, first of all, a feminine sign, right? The Pentacles, the Pentacles and the Cups are feminine energy, right? The Swords and the Staffs are uh, masculine energy. It's something here. Okay, so for some of you guys, y'all might need to tap more into your feminine energy, 
right it's something here about openness all right nurturing again all right this is a very nurturing loving energy flowers could be significant namely roses right now or tulips this emperor he wants somebody to cook for him take care of him in a in a good way is what i'm saying i ain't talking about no damn like you know what i'm saying no we need equal reciprocity so i'm over here cooking and cleaning you go ahead and you pay all these goddamn bills you understand what i'm saying <laughs> exactly collaboration right being open to it's something about you're gonna have to be open receptive okay how do we get receptive spirit we need to know thank you okay how we do this okay balance king of cups balance you got the queen and the king of cups here and the two of swords again pisces what is this spirit what is your sound what is your sound <clears throat> Let me see what deck I want to use. Hold on, Pisces. Hold on. Let's get the metaphysical deck. Oh, damn. <laughs> All right, Spirit. What is needed from Pisces right now? Ooh, sexual like i said some of you and then you got essence with sexuality it's something here about some of you guys like you feel good when you look good sometimes you know what i'm saying i know me personally if i'm not feeling my best when i go doll myself up bruh you can't tell me shit period i'm just saying right all right what is needed then you have transcend bliss and the void right some of you guys could be and there is another owl some of you guys could really be feeling in a lion this is this is the world or either the will of fortune one or the other because it got the four cardinal signs on here aquarius scorpio taurus and leo i think that's what taurus i mean. yeah something like that it's like transcending or like, I don't, I'm gonna go with transcending. And like, you finna pop out. Tell me about this though, what that is, spirit? The magician, look y'all, look, it was somebody else that had some on their head earlier too. I should have showed y'all, but was it the, somebody did. You see that infinity symbol, infinity symbol on top of the magician's head as well. Give me a moment. The color pink could be significant right now, yellow, okay? I'm hearing agape love. I forgot what agape means. <laughs> I know like philos is like brotherly love, but like what is agape? Is that like the ultimate love or whatever? I don't know. Okay. But we have transcend bliss and the void. It's like getting through this moment of silence or this like dry spell or feeling, you know what I'm saying? Like overlooked and things like that. And then tapping into some form of something that makes you feel sexy, that makes you feel good, that makes you feel loved wanted desired do you understand what i'm saying what i deserve what i desire wow i accept myself release my past and i'm ready for the next steps in my personal growth right so before oh shit y'all but before we can get into uh, receiving love from someone else we gotta know or we have to be we have to be in an energy of giving that to ourselves right we can't want no savior you know what i'm saying i mean you can want it all you want to but even jesus ain't coming back to save you you know what i'm saying like jesus gave us all the tools we need and told us that shit you know what i'm saying what jesus want us to do is reach christ consciousness which is already here you just got to tap into that shit but anyway it's something here about like 
there is 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 you, put yourself in that energy before it manifests right I was talking to my cousin yesterday and I was telling her about that and I was like hell I haven't felt you know what I'm saying love like genuine love on that in that degree in so long shit I done forgot how I feel you know what I'm saying and she had to like really like talk me off a ledge yesterday she was like girl you know what I'm saying she had to help me um, because I'm right here with you, Pisces. You know what I'm saying? I'm a Pisces and I'm I'm here with you, boo. I'm a single Pisces as well, right? But it says the more comfortable I become with receiving, the more abundance will flow into my life, right? We just talked about that. But how do we do this, spirit? Let me see how you feeling right now, Pisces. Messages from Pisces. It hurts much. How's Pisces feeling right now, Spirit? I'm sorry, y'all, if y'all hear Alexa. She's so loud, but she all the way in the front. I know she can't hear me. Oh, wow. Pisces. Pisces, stop with the sacrificing. Stop with the... No. Get a little mean. Shit. I don't know. That's not what I meant to say. I'm sorry. Maybe somebody needs to hear that, though. But it's something about, like people pleasing or sacrificing your happiness for others no make yourself happy i know what they've been teaching us you know what i'm saying oh put others first blah, blah, blah. you got to put yourself first if you don't look out for yourself then how the hell can you look out for somebody else you know what i'm saying when you are constantly pouring from your cup into other people's cups ninja who's gonna pour into your shit we got to pour into our own cup first. Make sure our shit is full so we can pour into others. But guess what? After you pour into others, you still got to bring that, you know, like bring it back to yourself and fill your own cup up. Nobody else is going to come fill that cup up for you. Right? You are too nice. I don't deserve your kindness. Yes, you do. You deserve all the kindness in the world. You deserve what you desire, period. No matter what that is. You understand what I'm saying? And then please do what's best for your heart. No, no. Like, no, don't. To me, this is an energy of like no strength. That's not strength right there. That's like, okay, you know what? I'm avoiding conflict. I don't want to have this conversation. I don't know. Something like that. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Hmm. The heat is, is intense. The heat between us is intense. Give me another one for how Pisces is feeling right now. This is a lot of lack, right? I can't take it anymore. I can't express myself. There may be someone, something, some energy that you might still be thinking of, attached to. I don't know. How is Pisces feeling in regards to love? Even if you, you know what I'm saying? We got to let go of something here. I'm not going into it. Y'all could really have like, have been in a very passionate connection with someone. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. And... You could have really, really felt connected to like someone very, very specific here for somebody. This ain't got to be fair, but 
and you may feel like it's no way that you could connect with someone else again on that deep of a level that that passion like i don't know maybe you feel like i don't know but i don't want to be alone no one understands me but you i have to let you go to find myself you do who or whatever this is pisces i'm glad that you know this though you know what i'm saying but on the bottom of the deck i can't let go of you What's your advice here for Pisces, Spirit? I walk confidently through new doors of opportunity, right? Three of Pentacles. Then you have come back into this present moment and breathe slowly and deeply. Mindfulness, Pisces. All right? Don't forget, you deserve what you desire. Have faith and trust. Advice for Pisces, please. Oh, I am able to find stability among, I'm sorry, amidst emotional upheaval. Two of Pentacles. Interesting. Anything else for Pisces here? How to manifest that emperor or for my guys, that empress. All right. I am open to receiving the divine gift of love, Pisces. I love you so much, my babe. <laughs> I hope that this message met you where it needed to meet you. It gave you clarity. Oh, I love it. I'm ready to begin a new journey from a place of empowerment and maturity. Right? Self-awareness is always key whenever you are working towards something you know what i'm saying finding out what the issue is so we could come up with a resolution right that type of shit i love you pisces i will see you guys down below or in the next video don't oh and definitely make sure you remember baby i am supported by the angelic realm you ain't doing this shit alone right you got support all right happy fourth of july again don't forget to like the video you guys share your planets pisces and for those of you who are um who haven't made it super duper official and become a vip citizen of your planet look down below in the description box for the link to that we meet every month to do a live reading for everyone um, so five dollars a month for your free reading so look down below jump on that pisces we do them at the end of the month so yeah uh, shout out to the vips and the planet tears of planet pisces i love you all so much i'll see y'all later bye pisces